it's time for a very early sneak peek look at the Doom of Malantai, the new unit for Tyranids coming soon in Elite Mod. Bear in mind that everything you see here is subject to change, tweaks, rebalancing and complete overhauls. This is literally the first implementation of the Doom. So let's have a look at it. It is a sub commander in tier 3. 400 requisition and 50 power at the moment. Let's look at the description. Legendary zone threat mutation that drains the life force of its enemies capable of casting powerful abilities. If you want to know what the heck a Doom of Malantai is, it was basically a legendary zone throat that completely single handedly screwed up an Eldar craft world that was called Malantai, hence the name Doom of Malantai. You can go and look it up on the internet and see the full story if you want. So let's have a look at the Doom. 750 hit points of commander armor since it's a sub commander also has 200 energy which we'll come to later and as you notice the doom of Manantai has an awesome absolutely fantastic custom portrait created by Hans Moleman awesome job he did and the abilities then starts off with a warp field much like the zone throats which is back here I have all these other units here so you can see the scale of the doom which is quite large as you can see does have a new model it's not just a blown up zone throat the head is different has all these spines on it has a different brain and it has the mouth of a much larger creature such as the Hive Ty Tyrant or the Carnifex compared to the zone throat as you can see quite different but moving along there is the warp field ability let's turn it off because it's loud so you can protect your doom of Manantai moving along Cataclysm, which is its big flashy ability, big area of effect damage, knockback, and damage over time on the ground. Let's see it go off. Does often miss its target at the moment, unfortunately. We're going to see you do get a slight um, time to react if you're an opposing player. It does leave a mark on the ground. There it is. And boom. As you can see, it went all the way back here. But look at the area of effect it does, big knockback, it does seem to decently damage vehicles as well. Decently quick cooldown also. Moving along then. Absorb life, much like the leech essence of the Swarm Lord drains health and gives it to the Doom from surrounding enemies. But it also improves the Doom's energy regeneration while it's active as you can see, which we'll come to later because that's very important and Spirit Leech which basically drains the energy of a target enemy unit and gives it to the Doom and why does it have all of these energy draining abilities because in the final version the Doom itself will not regenerate energy at the moment it does because this is a very early version of it but it won't regenerate energy naturally so it needs to rely on Absorb Life and Spirit Leech to get any energy back and of course it will have huge energy pressure from using Warp Field and using Cataclysm whenever it can. So we're going to see this very interesting dynamic from the Doom. Then it needs to get reasonably close to use Absorb Life and Spirit Leech to charge its shield and be able to use Cataclysm but not wanting to overextend and go down of course. It can level up. Has 300 energy at level 4. Not sure how much health it has at level 4. Has the same movement speed as a Zone Throat so it's pretty damn slow has pretty much the same basic attack as a Zone Throat. I think it actually does slightly less damage than a Zone Throat. Here we see it go off. Boom. Don't think it's going to be terribly effective versus vehicles. Does not have the snare that the Zone Throat has. I think the Cataclysm from what I saw does do a fair amount of damage to vehicles if you can hit them of course because you do have that delay before it goes off. And there it is, the Doom of Malantai coming soon for Elite Mod. I cannot wait. Tier 3 is going to be awesomely interesting for Tyranids now, not just Carnifex spam and the occasional Swarm Lord. We're going to see Dooms running around. Well, one Doom in a way. Thank you for watching, guys, and I will see you next time.